Hi everyone, another video on Tokyo, Japan. You could make seriously endless videos of this humongous city, the biggest in the world. Anyways, in this episode I'm going to Shibuya, one of the hippest neighborhoods and home to the Scramble Crossing, as well as I'm going to explore Team Lab's Planets exhibit. You've probably seen Shibuya Scramble Crossing. It's an iconic view of Tokyo and of Japan. What it is is basically a four-way intersection of streets, which allows traffic for five minutes and then pedestrian traffic for another one minute. And this repeats all throughout the day and night. Here's the view when the car's crossing, and here's the view when the pedestrians cross. This is why it's called Scramble Crossing. Even though most people here are pretty short, you still get a better view if you see it from above. Specifically, this Starbucks coffee on the right. It looks like you've spilled a bag of marbles on the ground. I guess no one really understands that metaphor, but... <laughs> Anyways, go to the Starbucks coffee, get your coffee, go up the escalator, and enjoy this view. And now let's see that sped up. It's honestly mesmerizing. I could watch this for hours, which I actually did. <laughs> I wouldn't say I really like ads, but I love this <laughs> Yayoi Kusama themed Louis Vuitton ad. They also have a memorial to Hachiko, Japan's favorite dog, who walked every day with his owner to the station and waited for him at work. And then when the owner died one day at work, he still stayed at the station day in and day out. This symbolizes Japan's love for dogs and loyalty. Next, I go to Team Labs Planets, an immersive art exhibit, and it's become one of to Tokyo's top tourist destinations, and it's been running for years now. It's easy to see why it's so popular. Just go there and you'll see. This actually has nothing to do with Shibuya, but it kind of fits the theme of cool, cool stuff to see in Tokyo. Like I said, this is immersive, so you're walking in milky water where they project images of koi fish in a pond. And what's cool about it is it's computerized, and so if you walk towards the koi fish, they swim away from you in a random pattern that never repeats itself.
this is the really cool mirrored hanging garden, and here is the indoor garden coming up.